Hi, yeah. You got a job on? Oh, one run hot and I'm back. Mm. So glad I get paid by the hour. <laughs> what about you? Uh, dirty Viv Butter and then back to packing sweets and boxes. Oh, life. So glamorous, isn't it? Proper fairy tale. Chaz, I uh, could really do with some extra cash. Can you please put in a word for me when you speak to Carl? Yeah, if I get a chance. In amongst all the scintillating conversation we'll be having. <laughs> it's not still like that. Mm. You all right? No. Uh, having fun? No. How are you? Fine. Carl, can we just go to go by? It'll work itself out. Good, because if it's down to me and him, it'll never get sorted. I don't know. Can't stand him when he's around, and then I miss him like mad when he's not. Come to the cafe for a coffee. Oh, come on then, a quick brew. Taking your fireplace for a walkie? Oh, well, yeah, I know a dog's more traditional, but I consider myself a bit of a trendsetter. Heavy, is it? Well, heavy enough to break your foot in 15 places when I drop... Oh! Try that and I'll sue you. Well, you'll have to sue Declan, won't you? Because I work for him. Not a fan of labour, is he? We could help you. I can't ask my mother-in-law to lift things. <laughs> I'll sue you if you call me that again. And by the way, you're a grandma. Ha! <laughs> Shut up. My van's practically empty. You're not going to get that in there, are you? Oh, are you going to do this because you like me? Yeah. That and that. Ah, well, that's a bit of a problem, you see. And you being a woman driver and this being worth a thousand quid. For that, I won't offer again. All right. But I will be over there in the calf when you need me. Mm. I mean, can you think of anything worse than having Nicola run that place? Yeah, living with her. The pub's supposed to be a place of refuge. So is a calf. Are you helping me or gossiping? Well, I can go back in there if you like. You could do these. What's this? That is an address, and this is from Declan. The services are to you are about to render. Oh, so tempting to comment. Shh. Fireplace? Yeah, not enough room in my van. Who would have guessed? So I was right! Oh, look at your little face. Bless you. Doesn't happen very often, does it? Does he want it shifting or not? And do you want this or not? <laughs> yeah, I'm the rest. That's all he gave me. Get him on the phone, come on. Ring him now, please. Wrong. Wrong. It's charity. Um, did you hear that noise? That was me falling off my chair laughing at your poxy 60 quid. No, 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 no. You're dead on your feet. Burnt myself before. Yeah, and you've been tired before. Like every day this week. I can get used to it. Look, go upstairs and have a snooze. And if I was able to do that, don't you think I'd be doing it at night? I'm sorry. Are you not sleeping? Not that you'd notice. Right, go on. Go up and have a rest at least. What, leave you on your own? Well, I'm not going to delve into the till. No, no, I'll be fine. Look, you've just admitted you're not. Leave well, it. Yeah, Look, insomnia can That's be dangerous. dangerous. I've got it's some pills, OK? All right. Right. What sort of pills? No. Sleeping pills, obviously. Fine. Fine. Well, let's see how good it is. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, when you get back. a lazy get you are. Well, that's when you're not around, I just don't know what to do myself. You've got to think of something. I'm off to Dortmund tomorrow. I know. I've got balloons. Oh. Not to throw a party when you're away, do you know what I mean? Uh-huh. <laughs> Make your mind up. Fancy a drink? I fancy a bath. I've been living a tent on fireplace almost single-handedly today. Well, good job you're a bit like a trucker. Are you ringing? My boyfriend. Hello, it's me. You know who? Don't pretend you haven't got me on speed dial with your favourite ring tool. Yeah, we'll really need to discuss money, don't we? Because I'd have to cough up. Coming to pay me a visit, were you? Oh, yeah, sure. Right, caviar. Cleaning fluid. Since when have you done your own dirty work? Since forever. Oh, that's why I've made a success of my life. Oh, right, is that what you've done? At least I managed to get by without blackmail. Oh, yeah, I'm glad you brought that up, actually. No, 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 no. No, no, 
no, calm down. Let the conversation run its course. This isn't a conversation. This is me telling you the gravy train's terminated. Oh, very gutsy. The important thing is that you understand, and if you don't, I'm sure you'll soon get the message. I wouldn't bank on it. You see, I'm not very good at getting messages. Your problem. No, I think you'll find it's going to be your problem. Oi! How long have you been back? Are you talking to me? Yes, I've been waiting. Jimmy said you were meant to drop off the keys. That was three hours ago. OK. Well, you was only meant to go to Hot, and what do you do? Push it back. So, am I right in thinking that you're buying the company? No. So you won't mind if you don't answer that? See you tomorrow. OK, will do. here knocking on your door. Yes, thank you. I've noticed. I've also noticed that you've yet to pay me. I don't care. Well, you'd better, first thing, or I'm going to go back to where I dropped it off and I'm going to start swinging an axe. You'll get it when you get it. Stop whining and start smiling. You'll live longer. Thinking winners. Look at me, tell me, do I look as if I've got that kind of talent? How'd it go, Isaac? You sorry. What's in that then? Gin or vodka? Just story issues. Blimey. Uh, two white wines, ta. Jimmy, hi. I'm really sorry about the Don't fire. Don't worry, you've told me all about it. Oh? Have they got it sorted? It? The power line that came down on Connaughton Road. Right, mess, she said. Pain in the backside was what it was. Been halfway to Leeds by the time I found a way back. Yeah, well, you should have sat and waited. Save burning diesel. Mm, yes. I'm getting off. You can't do yet. It's your birthday. Yeah, well, I'm worn out with all this wild celebrating. Say goodbye to all my guests. Yeah. I got here's your keys. Sure. I'll see you a bit. Yeah. Right. What's this? Was well, it not your birthday? Yeah. It's not from me, it's from our Sarah. Oh, she's a love. So. <sighs> yeah. Okay, let's have a drink. I was just going. We don't want it. Thanks, son. He's blue. Well, it's better than being yellow, which is where he's heading, if not stick to them. You said she was all right with him? Oh, and that she didn't hit him. She'd throw him a pie. Is that a good idea? Of course it is. They're the only kind I have. I chose you as my girlfriend, didn't I? Oh, is that how it happened? Definitely. Mm. I don't mean the usual, ah, lot do, you know. Ten crates of beer, a street fight and a caution. I just, it should be smaller. Everybody has to flipping well speak to each other and nobody's allowed to leave until it smiles all round. You're really being there for him, aren't you? Somebody's got to be. Hiya. What's that about? Oh, nothing, just a mate talking rubbish. With Jimmy. Right, just a bit of help. Why? Well, you seem worried. Presumably because I overheard you on the phone to... Who's it? And should I be worried? I don't know. Tell me what you're up to and I'll give you my assessment. Nothing. Right, well, next time you're up to nothing, just give me a bit of warning and I can come up with a better excuse. Think you owe a one. 